Hi, my name is Jess Meldrum from Keymetrics and welcome to today's episode of Two Minute Tuesdays. In today's episode, I'm going to demonstrate how to use conditional formatting in visualizations to help highlight favorable and unfavorable outcomes. To begin, I'm going to drag a column chart into the canvas. From here, I'm going to go to the data settings and I'm going to add a revenue account. The revenue account is located under GL accounts. On the revenue account, I want to change the version to budget. I'm now going to repeat this process for forecast. I'm going to add revenue account again by adding another account. This time, I'm going to change the version to forecast. I'm just going to expand the chart so that we can see it a little bit better. What we can see here is an FY 2021 overview of budget and forecast. To clean the labels up a little bit, I'm going to rename the accounts. For my budget account, I'm going to rename it to budget. Now for my account that I have the version set as forecast, I'm going to rename it to forecast. Now that I have the columns and time periods as I want them, I can start to add some conditional formatting. What we're going to do here is we're going to highlight the forecast in green if the forecast is greater than budget or in red if the forecast is less than budget. From the appearance setting on the left, I'm going to scroll down to conditional formatting and add a new rule. I'm going to call the rule greater than budget. The expression is going to be that forecast is greater than budget. Remember that we renamed our revenue accounts to forecast and budget. That means that we can just use the expression forecast is greater than budget. Note that I'm using square brackets here because I'm referencing an account. Now I'm going to change the color. As this is favorable, I'm going to change the color to green. I'm then going to choose my series. As I want this to be on the forecast data, I'm going to change the series to forecast. Then I'm going to click save. Now I'm going to repeat this process for when forecast is less than budget. I'm going to add a new rule and call it less than budget. In the expression, this time we're going to say that forecast is less than budget. We're going to change the color to red as it is not favorable and we're going to change the series to forecast. Now what we see is that our forecast data is green when it is favorable and red when it is not favorable. That's it for today's episode. As always, if you'd like to know more details or get further assistance, please reach out. Thanks and bye for now.